Hello all. In this video, we shall review the optical fingerprint sensor made by a Chinese company, SFG. This is the optical fingerprint sensor. This optical fingerprint sensor is uh, supplied along with the RS-232 breakout board. You can see four wires are connected from the fingerprint sensor to the RS-232 board. Out of these four wires, two are for uh, power supply and another two, one is uh, transmit and another one is receive wire. It is a simple TTL connection. This uh, supply voltage for this fingerprint sensor is around 3.6 to 6 volt and it withdraws 100 milliamps current. For USB connectivity, we are going to use one uh, USB to, to UART board. This is the USB to UART board using Silicon Labs IC CP2102. Connect this USB to UART board to your PC. This is the USB cable connected to the PC. And uh, use uh, RS-232 cable, straight cable. This is the RS-232 straight cable. Connect this to your uh, fingerprint sensor. You have to provide a separate power supply to this uh, RS-232 breakout board. We are using one uh, 12 volt adapter. So this is the setup for uh, testing fingerprint sensor. This SFG fingerprint sensor is connected, is supplied along with the RS-232 board. RS-232 board is connected to on USB to UART board, which is connected to the uh, PC. After connecting the fingerprint sensor to your PC, open up the control panel and the device manager. Scroll down to ports. There you see the Silicon Lab CP2102 recognized and it is allotted COM2 port. This is the USB to UART board we are using to communicate to PC and this is allotted COM2. Note on this port number. We are going to use one software, SFG demo software, which is supplied along with this uh, fingerprint sensor. Fire up the SFG demo software. This is the welcome window of SFG demo software. At the bottom left hand corner, you see open device button. You click on open device button. and you have to select the COM port allotted. From the device manager we have seen that uh, it is allotted COM2. So select COM2 and select OK. Now the device will communicate through COM2 port and the default baud rate is uh, 57600. Package size is 128 bytes and secure level is uh, 3. You leave it as it is for uh, default. The fingerprint processing includes two ports. First is the fingerprint enrollment and the second one is the fingerprint matching. To enroll the fingers you have to click on this uh, enroll button. The second one is the continuous enroll button for uh, continuously enrolling uh, many fingers. You can click the preview so that you can see the thumb view here. The user needs to enter the finger two times. The system will process the two time finger image and generates a template of the finger and stores it in a finger library. When matching the user has to enter the finger through the optic sensor. The template generated is compared with that of uh, in the library and result is displayed. 
Now we shall start enrolling the fingers. Click on preview and click enroll. You can enroll up to 164 address. Total 164 fingers you can uh, record in this demo software. First is a zero address. You click OK. Now it says please put your finger to sensor. Now we are going to enroll the fingers. Click on preview and then click enroll. You can store up to 164 address in this demo software. Starting is uh, starting address is zero. Click OK. Now it says pl please put your finger to sensor. And blue LED glows inside the fingerprint sensor. Place the first finger. Now it says uh, success image is transferring. Note that you have to place the finger twice. Now place the same finger again. Now it has successfully enrolled the first finger. Now place the second finger. You click on enroll again. This is address 1 now. Blue LED glows inside the fingerprint sensor. Place the second finger. It is uh, image is transferring. You have to place again the same finger so that uh, a template is created. Now place the same finger again. It is successfully enrolled the second finger. Now click uh, enroll again. Now it is address 2. Now place the third finger. It is transferring the image. You have to place the same figure again. It is successfully enrolled the third finger also. You can see the address 0, 1, 2, 3. Uh, 0, 1 and 2. We have enrolled three fingers. Now we are going to search search and match for the fingers. This thumb finger we have enrolled as a zero, address zero. Now click on search. Click search. This blue LED glows inside the fingerprint sensor. You place the thumb finger. Yes. It has find the same finger. That finger ID is 0 and it has uh, detected within 16 milliseconds. Click on search again. You place the middle finger. We have enrolled it as 2. Yes, it has identified it as uh, ID 2 and it is within 32 milliseconds it has detected it. Click on search. Place the index finger. It is, it is enrolled as ID 1. It is detected. If you want a continuous search, you click on CON search. If you are placing some other finger which is not enrolled, it will say that the finger is not found. Thus, uh, in its database, the reference is not found. 